why your dog doesn't eat whole fresh foods like you do? Well, they should and you can. Today I'm gonna to show you how to make a chicken pot pie for your dog filled with fresh whole foods in less than 15 minutes with simple ingredients you can find at your local grocery store. You're gonna need ground chicken, broccoli, carrots, peas, almond milk, fish oil, and dog child's essential nutrient mix. Today we are using Native Pets Omega Oil, which also has five simple ingredients. This recipe has a lot of the classics of chicken pot pie, but we've made sure that it's complete and balanced for your dog, getting all the right nutrients. Okay, so I'm gonna start out by chopping up our carrots and broccoli together in a food processor. I've mentioned this before, but the finer your chop is, the better it is for your dog to be able to digest all of the vegetables. So just throw this all in here. Uh, we also like to include things like the broccoli stem, and you can even use these if you have them hanging around from something you cooked. Um, they provide a lot of nutrients as well, rich with fiber and protein. We are going to add our ground chicken. Chicken is a great source of lean protein for dogs, especially those dogs that are looking to shed a couple pounds. Add this in, go on medium high heat. So now we're going to add in two cups of water. Really mix it all up. And then we're going to take our veggie concoction. So, as we said, this is broccoli and carrots. Broccoli is filled, filled with nutrients. And a fun fact is most dogs actually like broccoli. It's very tasty for them. And finally, adding in our peas, which are rich in fiber and protein. So I'm gonna mix this really well, get it simmering. We're gonna cover it for seven minutes or until all of the vegetables and the meat is thoroughly cooked. So I have a rescue dog named Cricket who came from Pakistan and when we first got her, her skin was covered in red marks, she was extremely itchy, she had constant ear infections and we were really worried about her bringing her to the vet constantly. Um, obviously as a fan of Dog Child, I transitioned her to Dog Child pretty quickly and within seven days we were able to clear up all her ear infections, all of her skin issues were gone and as you can see from the videos and photos she has a nice beautiful coat um, and I do credit that to Dog Child. So as I mentioned, you know, our nutrient mix is filled with probiotics, prebiotics and was really formulated for gut health and also skin and health coat. So if your dog has um, any sort of allergies, it can be tough to pin down, but I encourage you to experiment. Uh, with Cricut, we generally use lamb um, and then you can try fish sometimes, beef, chicken, whatever protein you enjoy. Um, and also just like we like to switch up our food, so do our dogs. We really highly recommend rotating proteins. So another one of our recipes, which I'd love for you to check out is our um, salmon and fried rice recipe. So once it starts to thicken, I'm just gonna add in some almond milk. This is gonna give it the creaminess of a traditional chicken pot pie, but along with protein from the almond milk. And it's always important to use unsweetened natural almond milk when you're feeding your dog. And then we're just gonna let it cook a little bit more and just get a little thicker. So when you're cooking with the white protein, such as fish or turkey, we always recommend adding in an omega oil. Um, so today, like I said, we're using Native Pets Omega Oil, which is five simple ingredients formulated to help with skin and coat. So we'll stir that in. And then finally we top it off with our dog child essential nutrient mix. We'll turn it off, mix this all in. Thank you and follow along for more recipes.